Hi, and today is February 16th. It's a Thursday. And for this morning, I'm going to be reading to you our topic for today. And our topic for today is all about uh, Australia uh, makes psychedelics uh, legal for medical use. So today I'm going to be reading to you this article. So I want you to please uh, listen carefully on how I read the text. And please uh, uh, take note of how some of the medical terms are pronounced properly. All right, so let's do this. Australia makes psychedelics legal for medical use. Australia has become the first country in the world to make psychedelics legal for medical use. The country's Therapeutic Goods Administration, DGA, announced on February 3, 2023, that MDMA and psilocybin have been approved for use by people with certain mental health conditions. The decision from the TGA means that from July 2023, authorized psychiatrists will be able to prescribe MDMA a drug also known as ecstasy, to treat post-traumatic stress disorder, and psilocybin, a substance found in magic mushrooms, to treat depression. MDMA has been found to make people slower to identify negative emotions while increasing their responses to positive in others. And psilocybin has been found to increase communication within the brain, causing increased feelings of happiness that can last long term. Psychiatrists in Australia wishing to prescribe these substances will first need to be approved by multiple medical authorities before giving the drugs to a patient and will also need a license to import them. Speaking to the, to the Guardian, Vinay Lacra, President of the Royal Australian and New Zealand College of Psychiatrists said the announcement is a baby step in the right direction for treating mental illness. Mind Medicine Australia Chairman Peter Hunt told Sky News there are currently few options for patients with treatment resistant mental illness. And while current medication often needs to be taken long-term, treatments from MDMA and psilocybin may only be needed a few times. Psychedelics have been, found, have been studied by scientists for years, with MDMA being used by some psychiatrists in the 1970s and 1980s. However, the spread of their recreational use caused MDMA to be banned in the U.S. in 1985, with Australia following in 1987. On January 1, 2023, Oregon became the first U.S. state to make supervised psilocybin legal with other states such as California now working toward similar laws. So there you go. So that's how you uh, read the uh, important um, words in this article. Uh, for instance, psychiatrist, psilocybin, uh, therapeutic, resistant, right? Uh, Post-traumatic uh, stress disorder or PTSD. All right. So these are how you uh, uh, pronounce uh, these uh, medical terms. And as I have mentioned in our class, uh, these words are mostly medical terms, um, and we don't usually talk about them in our conversations, but it's good to know some of these words, you know, in case you uh, encounter them in the future. All right, so thank you for uh, tuning in uh, this morning. Again, this is your teacher, Alan, and I'll see you again on the next um, edition of our um. English uh, reading class and pronunciation and uh, uh, credits to our uh, uh, source material for today, daily news uh, from ngo.com. Thank you for, for this material, for this news. I will be uh, back again for another um, uh, reading and pronunciation class uh, next time. Have a very wonderful day. See you.